Welcome and if you by DJS PRC. We have the Outcast from Arma 4S BLX on the table. And I decided to upgrade the rear. Wow. I decided to upgrade the rear hubs. Couldn't say that one. Uh, it's fine on mine right now. It is plastic. I did the front ones already. Um, I just want to put something a little bit stronger because I keep breaking these guys. I'm extremely hard on the machine um, to the point that close to every time I play with it, I might break apart mostly these hubs or the front hubs. And I break them on the bottom. Uh, but this is the uh, Hot Racing Aluminum Rear Hub set from Arma. It's the TFF22G01. It's fully aluminum bottom and the top is carbon fiber. That's the only part that I would love, maybe all aluminum, one shot, instead of having carbon fiber in this. But I'm guessing the reason they did this is to save weight. Because this literally weighs nothing. And they do give you some screws that you will need. Then let's put this body away. Grab a couple of tools here and let's remove our rear, our rear tire. Put our nut aside, remove this. Turn our guy here, remove our holding nut and throw it on the ground. Put that aside. Pop our pin. Now we need to go in the back with a two mil and basically remove our axle pin. Not axle pin, I mean our uh, hub pin. Remove that small screw. Put that aside too. Grab a smaller screwdriver that we had right here. Insert it here to push our a bigger hub pin. I don't know. You, I don't remember how you call these, but it's a hub pin at the end of the day. I say axle pin maybe. Yeah. Remove a screwdriver. This will pop out now. You'll be able to remove your drive shaft. I just screw right here. There we go, remove this, and we're done. This screw you won't need again, because they give you a longer one. Now what I do is, grab a screwdriver, enter it, put it in the hub, and slowly push on top of the bearing. It's like when I'm inside, I'm just pushing on the side here. And this one here, a little bit easier you push it up and what I'm saying in the beginning to remove your this pin a small hole right here you insert your screwdriver in and your pin will come out on the other side put that aside gonna reinsert our bearings Then we can reinsert our drive shaft or our axle, depending how you want to call it. Now I'm going to grab my top of my, and I'm back. A little bit of an SD card issue. Camera decided to go in error, but let's restart this. Uh, basically, we're going to reinstall our screw to our. Uh, Top axle, but our pin. Now, you don't necessarily need to put the nut backwards, but I do. Okay. 
and I'm going to tighten it until I get to the carbon and stop there. I'm gonna, not going to force it. Because carbon fiber is strong until it gets cracked. Now, on this guy here, because I have the RPM rear arms, this is extremely tight. It gave me issues when I did the other side. Because I did, just did this, uh, I did one that I won't have issues on this one, but I doubt it. Use my trusty hammer. There you go. Grab my retaining screw. Insert our axle pin. Put our tire back on. Grab our nut. Tighten our nut. There you go. And this is how you change your rear hub on an Arma BLX 4S for a hot racing. If you guys have any questions or comment, post them below. I'll be glad to answer you guys. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up. I do appreciate it. It helps the channel a lot. And don't forget, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. It does help me in the ratings. Thank you for watching.